What is that? That's a... Is it a... Merc? Scorpion? I don't know. Okay, damage boost. Boom, double kill. We just obliterated that guy. This is insane. This is shell bot. Boom, kill. We did it. We just did it. I don't know how this is possible, but the Norcom got a silent massive buff. I don't know when it happened, but this build is insanely like changed. 15 second reload, 1100 meter range. That's all the same. The reload is super long, but these are area damage rockets. So we can use the explosive expert skill. But what's gotten buffed since the last time I used these and no one was ever notified by Pixonic is they travel faster. So when they fire out of the weapon, they land faster on the opponents. There isn't as much of a delay and the damage is way more. We got double nuke amps with the nether we're using the nether over the capri because we can use the everett pilot so we can go through shields which is a huge deal to have a built-in shield breaker we got the explosive expert so 2.5 times bigger splash radius and the damage is nuts i'm doing this intro after the games i usually don't do that but i already used this and it surprised me so freaking much i thought it was gonna be some kind of like you know throwaway games where we're trying it out but it was for real plus the paralysis drones freezer lockdowner the slower the enemy the more damage we can deal to them and the robots that don't have that aren't pretty much tanks we absolutely tear apart it is actually ridiculous i don't even know what to say this is the most surprising thing i've seen in a very long time so let's get into the games beacon rush all right uh here we are on abyss map okay let's see how this works we have 1100 meter range i'm gonna fire at these guys right away hitting my healing so i get that damage boost I hit somebody. Who did I hit? Oh, I hit that guy. That, okay. That's way more damage than the last time I used these weapons. Okay, the reload is long. It's a 15 second reload. Oh, this guy's landing. Fire away. Hit the shield breaker. Whoa! That, I must have not been the only guy shooting at him. Okay, 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 okay. Remain calm, remain calm. So I'm hitting my dash right after I fire them so that my shield breaker gets activated. So... There's a shielder. We're going to go through it. Bro, we almost just one hit that guy. What is happening? They're, they're landing so fast compared to how they used to. Hold on. Fire. Healing. Dash. Holy hell. That was like 90% of his health. These are not the same Norcoms. This is the, this is the same build... Not the same build, the same weapons I used like a year ago. And they were not like this. Kill. There's a kill. We, we have a for real kill. We did all that damage. Okay, we're getting four cap right now. Oh, that's a, a siren. I think we can smoke that siren when he lands. This is this is crazy. I don't know what's happening. Okay, wait for him to land. He's gonna land in one spot. Oh, he's lagging. Heal. Fire. Dash. Oh, okay, we, we should have had that kill. We should have had that kill. So I'm firing. I'm hitting my healing for the damage boost. And then dashing. So I have the damage boost. Shield breaker. What is that? That's a... Is it a... Merc Scorpion? I don't know. Okay, damage boost. Boom, double kill. We just obliterated that guy. This is insane. This is insane. Our nuke amp isn't... Now it's almost loaded up. But all those shots... We weren't even with a loaded up new camp. This is, I don't even know what to say. This is the, the weirdest thing ever. It's like the rockets. I don't know if Pixonic increased their rocket amount. Like how many rockets are in each clip. Or if they just fire way faster. Because they definitely look like they fire faster. Like watch. He fire. Oh, he took off. Okay. No, oh, I might need to board here. The rockets are just landing so much faster than they used to. I used the Norcoms on the Kepri like 12 months ago. And they were absolute garbage. Oh, okay. This is the one. This is a weakness here if we get too close. Okay, that was a Titan. We kind of hit him. We kind of hit him. That Seraph is bugging out. I don't know why he's a foot off the ground. Okay, I'm going to the other side here. Um, okay, hold on. I want to get back to that spot we were before. In the back. Okay, healing. Boom, dash. Ooh, okay, I think that we did a good chunk of damage there. 
This is crazy. I never even heard about a Norcom buff. I don't know how, but I think it's more than the Explosive Expert. Maybe it's the Explosive Expert? I don't even know. Oh, I'm trying to... Oh, gosh. We're getting, I'm going to push back here. Fire Shield Breaker. Did we hit him? Okay. We didn't hit him directly there, but good chunk of damage. I'm still just running around with this Nether back here. The Shield Breaker is so useful. This is way better than the Kepri because of that Shield Breaker. Being able to use the Shield Breaker, we can just ignore shields. Oh, okay. That guy had a uh, an advanced Aegis Shield, so... We had to take down the shield first. Actually, um, I'm just realizing that our beacon bar is kind of disappearing. So, here's a Kepri here. On. See how fast those landed? It didn't land clean, but they just fire and land so quick. Oh, we're getting six. Wait, what's the... Is my team mecking? Okay, no, my team are coming back. Okay, um, I'm going to have to dish this thing soon. The healing... Boom. See, that didn't look like it landed flush. We were landing flush before and the damage was actually crazy. Oh, geez. We're getting some pressure here. This over... I might need to switch up this overdrive I have on. Because... Um... The, yeah, we're not even getting that low on HP. So it's kind of useless. Okay, that was some good damage. That was like most 50% of his health. Okay, abort, abort. The reload is still brutal. The 15 seconds is still a McMuffin sandwich. Oh, who's hitting? Oh, come on. Arthur. Okay, hit the Arthur. I don't know how much damage. I think we're going to die here. And we're going down. And we're going down. Okay, we need beacons fast. We need beacons fast. Okay, that was insane. But for the second game, I'm thinking something crazier. Because we're going to have to try another game with those Nork. Come on, die, 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 die. I I want to try going, like, up to enemies with a roof over top and firing Norcoms. I want to see if the splash radius is big enough where it damages enemies above me and in front of me. That's what I want to see. But we got to win this game first, man. Oh, I'm getting gravity amp. We need beacons fast. We need beacons big time. We're getting four cap. We're getting one back. Gravity amp right now. Die, 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 die. You suck, you suck. You are a piece of mick toast. There we go, Titan Flare. Oh, we're getting four capped. No. Uh, we're gonna... Uh, oh, okay. Um, That might have been partially my fault that we lost that game because I was camping in the Nether Norcom. But I think that might have been the most worth it loss ever because we did a ton of damage. So 2.7, top of the scoreboard, and we used mostly Norcoms. These are definitely adjusted. They fire faster. I think that's what it is. With the Explosive Expert, bigger radius, so you're hitting more enemies, and they're firing faster. Let's go game two. Okay, here we are on Moon Map. Okay, so this is a good map because Moon Map underneath the center, if I get in there, I think I, if I go underneath and I fire, hold on, see. I. Who do we hit? Who do we hit? Oh, we hit that guy. We hit him. We hit him. We took down like a third of his health. So I think if I go under center and I fire the weapons, the splash, because of the explosive expert, is going to be so big that it'll actually damage enemies above me and right in front of me. This guy's landing. Healing. Dash. Ooh, okay, we didn't land. I don't think completely, but we still took down some of that health. Okay, this guy's underneath. I think that's an angler, though. Is that an angler? I don't really want to engage the angler. Yeah, it is. Ah. Okay, hold on. Hold up, hold up, hold up. This guy. Shields, no problem. Boom, that was damage and he healed. He healed. He healed. I'm like tripping out right now. Like, I don't know. This is the, the weirdest, craziest thing I've ever seen in the game. Like, how, are, how is this possible? Like, I've used the Norcoms. Oh, man, this guy. I don't... This guy's not the next floor. The guy above me, the problem is he's on the very top of the the center dome. He's not on the floor above me. So I don't think it's going to reach him. Yeah. I think there's seraphs up there flying on top. This guy, dash. Oh, okay, that was some damage. That was some damage. 
All right, all right, all right. Remain calm, remain calm. We still have full health. We're in good position. 42 of the 95 on the new camp. I want an enemy to come at me down here, though. Where are these enemies at? Can we get a kill here? Can we get the kill? Can we get the kill? Oh, come on. How did we not get that kill? That seemed a little bit weird. After seeing how much damage we were dealing the first game. Oh, this guy's disappearing. Okay, can we grab the center now? We might be able to grab center beacon. All right, all right. We're good, we're good, we're good. Okay, this is the goal. I want an enemy to literally come down here and attack me. Oh, here's an angler. I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna go for it. Can we go dash in? We landed. We landed that damage. Okay, I'm gonna abort. And the angler is a, a tank, so it's gonna be more difficult. That's a max player from Omega. Omega's like a top clan. But we actually landed some of that damage when we were underneath. The explosive radius. This guy's just sitting there. Bingo! Bingo! That was a lot of damage. That was insane. Okay. Oh, this Seraph. I want this. I'm trying to bait this Seraph. I'm trying to bait this guy to come under this building center thing. Oh, come on, man. Mysterio, I'm trying to get this guy to come and attack me. Get over here. Ah, oh, he's not gonna... He's too smart. He's too smart. I need a, someone else to come and attack me down here. Because I can splash damage them. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Where are these enemies at? Let's go. Oh, this guy's right above me. He's right above me. Oh, this guy's just... Okay, I'm going to fire these. Okay, let's see with the damage. We triggered his last stand. We straight up triggered his last stand. Oh, this guy's gonna might attack. Oh, come on, man. Get under. He's taking off. All right. Let's use our... Another angler. Another angler. Okay, let's see how this goes. It doesn't even matter if we target malfunction. He's backing up. Nah, he didn't even go under the center. What a meatball. Okay, I'm not giving up hope. I am not giving up hope. All right, let's, what is this guy? Is this the angler? See, the problem is we can't fire an enemy super close to us unless we can splash the rockets off something. This is shell bot. Boom, kill, we did it. We just did it. We just freaking did it. <laughs> we, uh, we just deleted half a shell bot by going, by firing the rockets. It's too hard to explain. I fired the rockets into the ceiling and I killed them. Okay, it doesn't even make sense. Okay. Hold on. Fire. Boom. Double kill. Double kill. We have a double kill right now. We... <laughs> Imagine having even a double kill with Noricums. The clips are spaced up. You can only shoot every 15 seconds. So to have a, any kind of kill streak is pretty impressive. Because you need to absolutely kill them on every single shot. That Omega guy. Oh! He went into a phase shift or... His angler ability. Okay, I want to see if I can kill another guy underneath there. If somebody else comes down the center, I'm going to back up here. Actually, I'm going to kill this guy. These harpies and sirens are very good targets because they drop straight on the ground. Fire. Healing dash. Boom. Big damage. Big damage. Actually, I think that siren right there. Which one is it? I think it's... Which one is the siren? Is it... I think it's this guy, right? Okay, let's... Fire, heal, dash. Ooh! There we go! This, we're taking 50% of robots' health out with each shot. I've never been so excited about such a dumb build in my life. Okay, this guy's dropping, this guy's dropping. Let's finish him off. Healing. Boom! Another kill! Another kill! We cleaned him out in two shots. This is freaking crazy. This is absolutely absurd. We're still in the same bot, too. We're six min over six minutes in. Capri. Oh, he's underneath. I'm going for it. I'm going for it. Damage. Okay. That was maybe like a third of his health. He's gravity amped and we're suppressed. Okay, I'm going to keep moving here. We get a long reload. Man, the Kepri has so much durability. I don't know if we can take him down. Fire. Okay, there's a bit more damage. We locked him down too. I get a board. I think the Kepri is too much HP. 
I think the Kepri might have too much HP. Oh, actually, oh. If that Siren stayed up there, we might have been able to shoot him. Did I just dash into this guy and hit him? Oh, come on, come on, come on. Double kill. How do we kill him? Oh, we killed him with the Quake ability. We killed him with the Nether ability. That's kind of funny. Oh, see, I, I don't even think that... We were so close there, I don't even think the rockets landed. Oh, man, we're getting low on health. Bro, my team is losing too. Oh, God, we're getting five capped. We're getting five capped. We are getting five capped. Oh, no. Yeah, I'm getting gravity amped. Um... No, we didn't get any damage there. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna ditch this. Bro, I lost the game. We have lost the game. This game is over. This game is over. There's a kill that's worth nothing. We're five capped. All of their in... They got three Indras. Oh, this game is definitely over. I don't know how we lost it so fast. But I apologize, teammates. But I think it was worth it. I think <laughs> that game might have been worth it. Because that was the stupidest thing ever. Obviously, I wouldn't be like, build a Nether Noricum to dominate Champion League. 2.65 million damage with one Nether Noricum. We didn't even use that Raven at the end. These are Champion League players too. This is Champion League, man. That is the most insane thing ever. They were definitely buffed. Even though the Explosive Expert is allowing us to land more damage on each enemy because of the radius, the actual... They are, the rockets are landing faster. I'll attach a clip of me firing at an Erebus, and I deleted this guy. And I was deleting so many robots. This thing is insane, but it's not like, you know, overpowered meta, but it's still hilariously way better than it was. Peace. Cheese McMuffins.